You uh, people who don't really are not involved in porn or watch, let's like, say, mm -hmm. uh, a lot of women. People do remember you from your scene in Boogie Nights. So I yes. Some yeah. of the people are like Nina Hartley's going to be on the show. Like I'm not. I, well, I probably know her when I see her. I'm like, well, she was in Boogie Nights. But so many people have seen yeah. Boogie Nights, and mm -hmm. you had that great uh, relationship with Bill Macy, and you mm -hmm. were there, and everyone's watching you having sex with Go someone. Go away, Bill! You're embarrassing me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the guy blows his head off. Right. right. Yeah. <laughs> After shooting her. Hey written that way I wouldn't have written it that way but Paul Thomas Anderson wants to write it that way now how was it working with him because two of my favorite movies are Boogie Nights and Magnolia man great movies um Paul Thomas Anderson was a great director I really really liked working for him I'm sorry he hasn't called me back but I loved it because he had an idea very quiet very low-key if he didn't like the take he'd say you know let's try it this way never yelled never screamed knew what he wanted just absolutely kept wonderful control on the set I never saw him lose his cool get perturbed um, he was great, and I would, I would love to work with him again anytime. Now, what about that Bill Macy? He's the best guy in the whole world. He is so cool and wonderful and neat and fabulous, and I just love him. I just love him. If he, he's a great actor. He's, he's a great actor. actor. He's a great, and he's a great human being. He's a devoted husband to his wife, who they're madly in love. They have two great kids. He's just, he is as good a person as you think he is. Now, I want to ask you something that always seems, you now you must be recognized a lot. Yeah, yeah, actually. I mean, a lot. You must mm -hmm. walk around. At least twice. At least twice. When I'm dressed down, no makeup, wearing uh, jeans, at least twice a week I'm recognized. Okay, at least twice a week, sometimes more if you're mm -hmm. at an event. Now, yeah. do a lot of people approach you to try to have a date with you, or that it's like maybe they think you might be easy to have sex with? I mean, what, what, what's, what's it like being Nina Hartley? It's, well, I love being Nina Hartley I've, um, because, remember, I, I started becoming Nina Hartley for my own needs my own needs of sexual mastery, my own needs of exhibitionism, my own needs of sexual education. I got my training as a nurse, and nurses educate people. And people are very ignorant and scared about sex. I'm interested in sex, hmm, 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 okay, <laughs> I'll go there. So I, for me, my being in adult entertainment is quite frankly, my needs. And at the same time, I really like, I love having this dance because I like being a person that anybody can come up and ask any question about sex and not be, and know they will not be dissed or uh, I won't feel insulted, I'm not going to get upset, I'm not going to look down at them, and they can just say, what, it, what up? So, and everyone's very polite, so here it comes up, they come up to me, it's like, no, in passing, love your movies, love your movie nights, mm -hmm. is your name Nina? And, and, and have, what about women? Do they do, do they do the same they, as well? They, 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 they on the street are less likely to come up to me, unless you're with their boyfriends, and then it's like, and, 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 and so they'll get her, they'll get him yeah. come up and say something to me, and she's yeah. like in, in the background, like jumping up and down. That's great because my, my joke is, I, I told you this to Bob earlier. I can't fuck all those women, so I need your help. I'm so here. I'm, yeah. You know, I can't fuck them. I could try. I can.